Today I'm going to change the chain case oil on the snowmobile. I'm going to do it on this 2002 Skidoo 500F. Let me show you a couple of things that you're going to need. Here's some things that you're going to need. Some oil or automatic transmission fluid. I'm going to use a chain case oil because it's meant for a chain case, but you can use the automatic transmission fluid. Going to need some brake cleaner to clean the inside of the chain case. You're going to need some rags. And then you're going to need either a pair of ice grips, an exhaust spring removal tool, or a flathead screwdriver that has a no notch cut into it to remove the exhaust springs. Then you're going to need some wrenches, sockets, and Allen wrenches. And then you're going to need some oil absorber. Here are a few things you don't need, but will definitely help out. A magnetic tray to put all your bolts in. Some latex gloves so you don't get oil all over your hands. And an electric impact wrench, if there's enough room in your snowmobile to use it. Otherwise, you'll be stuck with a ratchet. To get started, you're going to want to take all the exhaust springs off to get the exhaust out. I'm going to try using that screwdriver that I cut a notch into, and we'll see if it works. Remember to grab your exhaust springs so you're not trying to find them later. Then just go ahead and pull the battery out, and I guess we'll see what we have to do after that. So after looking at this, turns out we will have to remove this part of the exhaust. There are two bolts right there and one right there and then I think it'll come right out And now the exhaust should pull out. Okay, now there's two nuts that hold in the front of the battery tray. One right there, and there's one underneath the chain case. They are they're 15 millimeter. 15 millimeter. And I'm going to take them off now. Alright, now we're ready to take off the chain case cover. Now you can see I have a plastic bag with some oil absorbent in there and then underneath the snowmobile I have a bucket just to catch any oil that drips through the exhaust port and the bolts on this chain case are 10 millimeter. Alright, and I think, I think it's ready to come off.
So I'm just gonna, yeah, it's loose. So we'll see. See all that oil down there? Yeah, that oil is old. That bucket on the bottom, I kicked it. I kicked it earlier. Looks like that the gasket on here is still in good condition, so we will be able to reuse that. But yeah, this oil is old. Alright, then you just want to spray the inside out to get all the excess oil and other gunk out. So. Remember when you're cleaning out your um, chain case cover that you don't spray the gasket because it can damage it if you spray it with brake or carb cleaner. All right, then you just want to put your chain case cover back on. Now we're gonna try and uh, put this oil in. Alright, now time to put the battery tray back in. Now I gotta put the exhaust back in. There we go. All right, then you're just gonna wanna put the battery back in. Alright, then you'll then you'll just have to put the exhaust back down and just line um line it up with this hole. There we go. And we can put on these exhaust springs. <laughs> 